Hey friends, in today's video I'm going to share with you 10 period hacks that will make you feel good and fresh during that time of the month. I'll also share with you a bonus tip and a fun fact at the end of the video so make sure you watch until the end. So let's start with number one which is drinking ginger tea. Ginger tea has anti-inflammatory properties so having ginger tea reduces period pain and it also helps to control heavy bleeding. And the beautiful thing about a ginger is that it is readily available so you can actually prepare this right at home. Number two, it's eating chocolate. Yeah, eat chocolate, especially the dark chocolate. Actually, this is my favorite treat during this period. I really love chocolate. So what chocolate does, it contains high amounts of cocoa beans, which are high in magnesium, potassium, and iron. So these minerals help relax the muscles and may stop the production of compounds that signal crabs. Number three, it's holding a hot water bottle over the crab zone. So the heated water bottle boosts blood circulation, which can reduce pain, and it also helps in relaxing the muscles of uterus, which causes crabs. Number four, it's resting. Yeah, make sure you get sufficient sleep so that your body can reset and rejuvenate. Number five, wear black clothes or dark colored clothes during this time of period. Just in case you stain your clothes, will not be worried what people will say about the stain or you'll not just be embarrassed, yeah? Number six is exercising. Yeah, make sure you relax with a gentle exercise just make sure you stay active maybe by dancing simple walk or any other exercise you are comfortable with so exercising increases oxygen availability in uterus and this helps in reducing pain caused by period cramps Number seven is drinking enough water. Yeah, just to make sure you are hydrated. Dehydration stresses your body, so remain hydrated. Also, drinking enough water helps getting a heavy flow away. Yeah. Number eight is eating healthy food. Yeah, make sure you eat right. Avoid high salt food, they increase pain and bloating. Also, avoid fat foods to have balanced hormones and avoid coffee and alcohol as well to make sure your sugar levels are stabilized. Number nine, 
make sure you shower at least twice a day and make sure you do it with a warm water yeah so showering of course will help you to avoid the smelling bad or the bad hodua and it will also help you um, avoid um, getting infection number 10 and the last one it's make sure you change your menstrual product every two to four hours this will prevent um or rather you will avoid infections and also the bad odor now to the bonus tip uh, yeah so guys i don't know whether you've experienced this and if you have let me know in the comment section so sometimes you think you are just done with the menses and after a day or two it surprises you you just see some stains on your panty so what i would advise is you wear um, panty liners after like two to three days just immediately that you you are done with your menses just to avoid staining your panties yeah yes and that is the last tip that i'll be sharing with you guys thank you so much for watching this video i really appreciate if you haven't subscribed please i don't know what you're waiting for subscribe if there's another hack that you use and it has helped you share in the comment section sharing is caring yeah